So ayahuasca basically has two main groups of components, dimethyltryptamine and monoamine oxidase inhibitors. These two components act on monoamines in our brain, so in neuroreceptors that receive or that interacts with monoamines, such as serotonin. So the main mechanism uh, behind ayahuasca seems to be an interaction between the substances present in ayahuasca with uh, serotonin receptors present in our brain. It's like you have a key and you have a locker. The key is dimethyltryptamine, for instance, and the locker are the receptors for serotonin that we have in our brain, which seems to be the same locker for dimethyltryptamine. So dimethyltryptamine couples to uh, monoamine receptors such as serotonin. But the effects of it, it, the, it, it, we cannot really say that there is an effect behind, it's, it's just a, a mechanism. But uh, this type of mechanism is present in our everyday life. I mean, we have serotonin in our brain that locks to their own receptors in our brain and that's responsible for many behaviors. Um, from desire to, uh, to mood disorders, uh, emotion. So all of these processes somehow have been linked to these type of receptors that ayahuasca seem to modulate.